Wait, this guy's like... <laughs> Dude, these imperms are like right on time, man. Right on time. <laughs> The, the FTK. Shipyard Enchantress. Oh, it doesn't get better than that. Another Fountain. Just the tip. Yo, what if I Ash tip, right? That's how that works, right? That's how you, you punish. Uh, apparently, that's what you're supposed to do, right? It happened to me the other day, and I lost the game to it. I'm just going to Ash the tip, and it's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. He simply will not have anything good. He'll have nothing. Draw one shit card. Draw two. Okay, new hand. New hand. Goods? Oh, nature, yeah. Nice. It's fine, I win. I win the game. Don't worry. I am not worried at all. This is a W of all time, chat. Don't worry about it. Just just trust. I win this. Damn, that's kind of good. <laughs> Fuck. Um, that's a little good. Wait a minute. Hold, hold up just a second. He's blessed. Hashtag blessed. Check and Baron to get a card or effect or just spell trap card. When the fire really do be flashing. <coughs> card or effect broken. Okay, another fountain. Is he gonna try to draw more? Is he making Jerry? Like, does he make. Oh, he might go fountain, Stardust Charge, draw one. And then go Fountain into Jerry, add back Fountain, draw three. Yeah, fuck, man, that's rough. That's a lot of cards. A lot of cards. That's a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh cards right there, brother. Playing against Runicus Pain? No, I think it's fine. It feels like a game of chess. For reals. Chess is pain? I don't agree. Honestly, I might just pass. Because the thing with Runic decks, right, they need to keep in mind is because of the no battle phase restriction, if you just pass, uh, like, usually they can't improve their board much more than it already was turn one anyway. Huh? Okay, so we're not making Baron. Oh, okay, never mind. Never mind, this is okay. He wants more cards. More cardboard. More. More cards. He gave me Droplet. My Griffin! Fuck! Hit my white beard. White beard right now. Fuck! Why no hit white beard? The fuck? Oh my god. Okay, my enchantress is no longer good. <clears throat> Droplet goes crazy here? Not really. Because I have no response to the fountain. It's okay, this is winnable, chat. I have the sauce. I have a crazy play incoming. You guys aren't ready for what's about to happen. Okay. When the beast is Naturia. He's gone through triple sacred tree, triple blessing, by the way. <clears throat> Negate this, Nat Beast, I dare you. That's a Yu-Gi-Oh card. I have to play now because I committed so many cards. I can't just pass. I literally cannot just pass. That's fine. Nah, none of these cards do anything. I, I can't make anything without him drawing to infinite Renick spells. So, hell. Bro, I'm so done. I'm so done. This is a one for six trade. It's worth it. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, it's worth it. Run it. Did you add pep yet? No, I'm supposed to. I should be adding pep. Wait, if we both have pep, then our peps just crash, right? That is a decent out to pep, is having your own. Because they both gain, so they crash. Have you sent your own mana peel to Konami? I have, yes. Honestly, dude, I think the only thing that makes it so that Sword Soul isn't by far the best deck in the game is because Maxi exists. Sword Soul is just one of those decks that gets so fucked on. By Maxi. It's nuts. It's actually crazy. If you also make Cheng Ying, then Pep can kill theirs. Uh, fair. Wow. Normal summon Nimble Angler. 
Yeah, go ahead, summon sprite monsters. Surely you don't just pass here. <laughs> That's a horrible sprite hand you got there, homie. It might be Runic. He had something in end phase. I doubt it. If it was Runic, he would just chain, right? It's like I never activated Maxi in the first place, dude. Wait, this hand is like sussy. I banished double Moye. I mean, I'm not too mad about this, to be honest. I gotta just do this. And then you cook next turn. Fine to me, dude, to be honest. This seems completely fine to me. Duality in Sword Soul is crazy. No, it's not, because it's not searchable. I wouldn't play a card like that that's like, oh, you need to build stuff on your board and just hard draw this card. Forget it. I'm not giving a single extra deck slot to that. Do you play Nib? I think I do in this deck. I'm not sure. Do I play Duster in my list? I don't think I do. I mean, I lose nothing in trying it, I guess. I don't. Okay, what Tenyu would I like to add next turn with a Nadara? Like a Shana? I'll do this. Ash? No, no, I don't I don't care. He doesn't have Ash for my, uh, my thing. He doesn't have Ash for it, Chad. Don't worry. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, Chad. He doesn't have it. He doesn't have Ash Blossom. Add Adara. Then I go Adara. Monk. Adara adds a Shana. Summon a Shana. Yeah, it's just time for Oh, right, because I could have used a Circle Grave effect. It's fine. I'll just search it with uh, on the next turn, on the following turn. So I go Normal Taya, banish something from Grave, and then when I have the token, I get to use this to search for whatever the fuck I want. Yeah, we're chilling. When the frog is swapping. There you go, Maxi. Do it. Hey, look at that! No Ash! Let's go. Now he's going in. Wait. Wait, I die to Gamma Burst, don't I? Hold up. Hold the phone. I die to Gamma Burst, don't I? Can I draw a hand trap, please? Can I draw a hand trap, please? Hand traps, where? Hand traps, where are you? Imperm Ash, hello? Hand traps, please. Please. I'm, conf I'm, I'm terrified right now. Oh, nay. Please, bro. Imperm off of this jet summon right now. Yes! Yes! I deserved it! Yes! Oh my god. Check him PC, bro. This is not normal. Check him PC right now. I always had it, bro. I was never not imperming that jet. My deck said, I got you, homie. I got you. Elf, you don't have Gamma Burst in your hand, would you? You wouldn't have you wouldn't have Gamma Burst in hand, do you? There's no way. You would there's no universe you have Gamma Burst in hand, dog. Right, bring back the red. No way. There's no shot in hell. There's absolutely no way. Come on. Okay, you wouldn't do this. Wait, does Cat Shark win here? 32 plus 14 plus 14. Deck out. Bro, you can't deck me out. I have like infinite cards. 14? That's too many. Ass! Bro, why didn't I draw Ash on the sprint to be an epic gamer? I can't Ash anything anymore. If he had Gamma Burst in hand, he should go Battle Phase now and kill me. So he doesn't have it. What if he makes Cat Shark with these two and then Gigantic with these two? That's game, right? Make Mosquito? That's not in the game. Wait, how does Cat Shark interact with Gigantic Sprite? If the Gigantic Sprite is 32, does Cat Shark put it to 64? Or does it have some weird wording that its attack becomes double its original attack or something? Yeah, it does. Yikes, I am terrified right now. It becomes a Nintendo 64. Got you, got you, yeah. It becomes one singular Nintendo 64. Mannequin? What is Lil Bro cooking? Maxi. I don't want to know what he's cooking. I'm ashing this. I don't want to know what he's trying to cook up here. I genuinely don't want to know. I don't know what this guy's game plan is. Battle phase, sure. So what I'm understanding is I'm not dead. And then I just go, Protos call dark, win the game. I could Protos call fire, actually. 
I think I have uh, enough cards in my hand, I think. What do you guys think, chat? Kato. Oh, shit. Wait, this guy's like... <laughs> Dude, these imperms are like right on time, man. Right on time. <laughs> right on time, man. Special Ecclesia. I probably should have summoned Tenyis first, but whatever. It's not like it's going to matter. Yes. Activate Caddy. Turn on my tactics talent. I'm super down. Thank you. Thank you, bud. Appreciate you. Uh, I will now tactics to Yoink. I'm going to take one of your monsters now. My monster, please. Chain Elf, by all means, yeah. Summon Red. Uh, yoink. Yoink. I'm now going to summon Protoast. Uh, Protoast by banishing Maxi, uh, the Red that I stole from him, and my Taya from my graveyard. Your toast. Mannequin Cat to summon a Dark. Whoa! That's a real card. Can I summon this again? Yeah, I can. That's funny. I can summon this again. You know, I'm just gonna summon it again. I'll just, I'll just do it again. Effect. Did he not Mannequin Cat? Okay, uh... If my girl and Mo Ye are both drowning... Catch me at my girl's funeral, revealing Protos in my hand to summon a token. Dude, I don't even know what to summon here. I'm not going to lie. I know what the fuck to summon, bro. There's too many plays. I'm going to make Draco Berserker. I see it, Chad. I see it. Uh, I'm going to go this. Chain this. I think there's just Chungus Bungus do a lot of damage is the play, right? to hand. Yep. And now I get to summon Protoss again. Banishing fire, earth, and light. I'm going to call fire now. I am now going to call fire. No, I'm going to call earth, to be honest. This is, this is once per turn, right? I'm just going to call earth. I'm going to do this. I'm going to pitch Vish. Effect, summon this. And now I'm going to summon the Chungus Bungus. And your monsters will all be on zero attack points. And my monsters will all be on 10 billion attack points. And I just win the game in this position. Burn for 12. Would you look at that? That's a lot of damage. I'm going to normal summon Taya. I'm going to Taya now. I'm going to banish the Moye. Chungus Bungus. Banish the Mannequin Cat. And the Ronin Toten. He's already dead? No, I didn't have game on board. I'm putting game on board now, don't worry. This is game on board. Uh, swing that. Yeah. Effect! Boom! See? Game on board, I told you. I just wanted to make sure that I had game chat. I'll be honest, chat. I'm going to be honest. I never BM. I just always make sure to put a fuckload of damage on board. Just because I I don't... I can't do the math myself. So I just... I just want to make sure I have enough damage on board.